the fans deserved to be able to touch and take pictures with that trophy. This is truly the Commonwealth's team. Hard for people throughout this state to get to Lexington. And if they do, when are they ever gonna see that trophy? Well, that's why I felt it was really important to take it out to the state, to have people be able to touch it, take pictures with it. Thanks, guys. Groups of 20. All right. Coach Hall came with us. You ask about the whistle stop. If the train would have been able to take us for dip to throughout different parts of the state, we would have done that. We went to Midway, which was a great time. We went to the Capitol in Frankfurt, which was a great time. Um, and everybody got a chance to touch it, take a picture with it, and get to see that trophy. Um, it was a good time for everyone. Together. You're not out there with your look. It's overwhelming when you think I gotta go out here and play. When you're out here to just play with your teammates, how can I make everybody on the team better? Now it's not so bad. Alright? Les Jones moves into the center circle. We're about to get the season started for the Cats. And the tap's controlled by Kentucky. Kicks it left side to Goodwin. Dumps it down to Noel. Turns into the paint. Jump hook is good with the right hand. First basket of the season by Nerlens Noel. Excellent footwork. Here's Goodwin driving at the other end, gets hammered and puts it in! Count it and Archie Goodwin will go to the line. Yes, sir. Steal out front by Mays, pick the pocket of Aaron Holt. Mays driving to the other end, lays it in with the left hand! Left side to Mays, fakes the three to Goodwin in the corner, lobs it down to Cauley Stein. Cauley Stein dumps it off to Polson down the lane, lays it in! Kicks it back to Polson. Polson goes by his man, dishes to Cauley Stein. Cauley Stein, left hand hook, no good, gets his own rebound, puts it up and in! Back to Mays, open three, right side, good! Kentucky's first three of the night. Shot clock at nine, Olsen drives left, bounces to Wiltshire on the pick and roll, shovel to Cauley Stein for the dunk! Archie angles left, pulls up with an 18 footer, rims out, no good, tap Polteris, no good, tapped out front to Polson. free throw line jumper, yes! How about the young fella? Cats lead by nine, Faust down the lane, tries to dunk over Cauley Stein who got a piece of it, Wiltshire comes out with the ball. Off to Polson. Fires it up into front court to Cauley Stein. Kicks it across to Wilcher. Open three, right side. Yes! That's what John Calipari wants. Left side to Wilcher. Goes into the circle. Goes into the lane with a 10 foot runner. Good. Tough shot. Wilcher, deep three, straight away. It's good. Strong rebound by Wilcher. Clears it to Goodwin coming into front court, right side. Drives down the lane, gets to the rim, puts it in. Wilcher, three, straight away. Good! What a first half Kyle Wilcher's having. Three threes and 11 points. 44-34, three right side. Goodwin rattles and stays. 13 for Archie Goodwin. Comes to the top of the key, down the lane, by Lynn, lays it up, no good. Rebound, Cauley Stein, follow, no good. Jammed in by Poitras. Cap it out to Harrow, right side to Poitras. Gets into the lane, dunks it! Goodwin out deep on the right side, cut off, drives down the lane, leans, and lobs it up for a dunk by Noel. Thought Archie was going to lean in and shoot it, and he saw Noel rolling off a pick, and he slammed it home. Harrow to Wilcher, three, right wing, got it. Feeds Wilcher, Wilcher backing down, turns, right hand, hook, good. I like it with either Wilcher, Nerlens Noel, or Willie Cauley-Stein at the block. Back to Mays, feeds it to Noel, backing down, turns, and goes up with a shot, no good. Followed in by Polson. Smallest guy on the floor. Wells down deep on the right side, comes to the top of the circle, tracked by Goodwin. Gets past him, down the lane, runs over Noel, charging. Nerlens, second of two, is in the air. It's no good. Rebounded by Maryland. Polson knocks it away, puts it up, and it goes! What a play by 
Jared Polson came up with a steal, slid over to the left side, flipped it up with a Whitaker bank shot. How sweet it is to have him in this position. Shooting for a three-point lead and his tenth point. One dribble. He sets, he fires. It's good. Dead center on both. And Kentucky has prevailed in its opener. First of all, give Jared Polson. <laughs> And you know what? The two free throws you made at the end. Look, I'm telling you, the good news is I've been doing this 25 years. One game to me, we need to learn. Them coming back was good for us. Now, you two had to learn. I missed an offensive play, and I lost my mind going back. Did they not, Julius? And he's not being like ratting. He's just saying it because he said it to you. He said it to you. We got to learn from that. These, it doesn't matter what happens, just keep playing. Willie makes two free throws, huge. The biggest play of the game is where I told you two, you go in. And he went in and got that rebound and went under and made that. That was the game. UK Athletics is still making great strides in building a successful, comprehensive athletic program. This could not have been achieved without support of the fans, donors, and sponsors. UK Athletics and UK IMG Sports Marketing wish to extend this special thank you to our following official corporate partners. McDonald's, Central Bank, Coca-Cola, Gatorade, Kentucky Farm Bureau, Kroger, Nike, Papa John's, and UK Healthcare. Hi, this is John Robick, and this week's edition of The Hot Seat, I have former UK great, standout, non-shooter, draft pick of the Houston Rockets, Terrence Jones. Terrence, welcome to The Hot Seat. Hey, it's great to be here with such a, a great person to ask these questions. I mean, a, a guy that's... Probably the best host. Yeah, definitely. And um, I'm just excited about being here. Now what what are you doing in what are you doing in town right now? You're in your old locker room right now. Where was your where was your dirty locker? It was over there somewhere. It never closed because you had too much stuff in it. And I'm used to seeing number three up there. What number are you gonna be wearing for the Rockets this year? Um, six. Three was gone. Yeah, it was already snatched up. You couldn't pay the guy. I mean, I know you're tight with money, so you weren't gonna offer much. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wanted three, but. I mean, I just was going to roll with whatever. Just I was excited about just being in the NBA. So I just wanted to have whatever number was possible just to have an NBA jersey with my name on it. That's, I mean, that's terrific. And you're down there right now with Patrick's down there and Josh is down there via a trade. We watched you play quite a bit on TV in the summer league. Tell us a little bit about that experience of your first taste of NBA basketball in the summer league. I mean, it was really exciting. It was just... Uh, the first time we actually got to step out with the NBA logo on our jersey. So for me, it was just exciting and just to see my mom there, have all my friends and family to see me playing in the NBA setting for the first time was just a great feeling. You, 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 were, you had impressive numbers during the summer league. And now what, what's the difference? I know it's just summer league and it's not your whole team, but what do you think will be the biggest difference between NBA play and the two years that you played here, like style-wise? And what do you think the differences are, just, you know, real quickly? Um, well, first off, just being in the lane um, is different. I mean, how much, how spread the court is when it just comes to spacing and how, how much you just got to be in shape just to keep up with everything is just a difference from the college. Now you know why Coach Payne always got on you. I know you're real close with Kenny, like everybody is here. And I think that's one thing that's neat about it. We have great relationship with the players. But conditioning is going to be important, isn't it? Definitely. I mean, for you to be able to knock down, you got to be in shape. So Now yours, yours usually start here and, then you turn to and go here because not too many of them go in. Did you hit any three balls in summer league? I mean, I, I, I hit a, I hit a couple. Actually, did you hit one? Yeah, I hit, a, I hit like a couple, you and did. I, and I had to keep it up too. Now, did you play against any of your former teammates in summer league, and who'd you play against? I mean, I played against Marcus, 
And I went and seen every one of my teammates play. Uh, I seen, I went to Duran's games, I went to Michael's games, and Darius. So, but, but Marcus was the only guy that you actually played against. You didn't play against the Bucks or any any of those other teams. Mm -hmm. But I definitely was a fan, so I, I went to all, every game. I pretty much didn't even leave because everybody played back to back. So I was pretty much there all day. It's it's nice when you guys come back. Just to, you know, as soon as you get back, you feel like you never left, you know, and talking to some of the other guys and you feel comfortable here. And uh, how often will you be able to get back? Like, will you come back in the summers at all just to check in and maybe do some workouts or something like that? Definitely. I mean, this is my second home, so I'm going to be coming here all the time. Yeah, it's, it's nice to see, see guys come back. Now, have you, have you found a place in Houston to live yet? Have you started looking? When will, what's the process there? Um, yeah, I've already narrowed it down, so I'm just waiting to get back to actually go look at them and get to pick one. We appreciate you coming back, being on the hot seat. We wish you nothing but the best, and when, whenever you're back, make sure that you give them a big sign-off, give them a little three goggles into the camera. Terrence Jones. The hot seat, T. Jones, it's over. My favorite meal is uh, anything my parents make, probably they make a good pasta and uh, yeah, a lot of seafood when I go back home while I was there. But I myself am a good cook. I chose to come to UK because I thought it was a great opportunity and uh, I loved how big the fan base was and how great of a school it is. I've only dunked a couple times uh, before I had all these knee surgeries and I didn't really have that big of a reaction because I figured I'd be doing it a lot more, but only, only a once in a lifetime thing, once or twice. I'd probably be traveling, maybe like uh, going overseas or something to see the world. Hi, this is John Robick, assistant coach with the University of Kentucky Basketball, and welcome to another year's edition of Inside the Play. We're going to go back to our game against Duke at the Georgia Dome. One thing we're doing, like last year, is we're telling all our players to run wide. That opens up the floor. So in this case right now, off the rebound, Julius Mays has the ball. You can see right now, we love where Nerlens Noel is. We love where Alex is. Kyle is the trail man you can't see in the picture yet. You see Archie getting, uh, Goodwin getting ready to run wide. So as Julius pushes, we don't particularly need to get the ball to a point guard to run. So as Julius pushes the ball, everybody's wide. That is terrific spacing. Now, at this point in time of the year, we are not going to hit ahead to Nerlens to finish. If we can throw it over the top as he runs, coming from the referee in, that's great. But Archie's pushing Nerlens down. Alex staying wide, terrific. We want to get him wide and low, and Kyle is a trailer. So Julius makes a great read and a hit ahead. Nerlens, we got Nerlens in the post, but Archie recognizes that no one picked up Julius. Ryan Kelly from Duke should have picked him up. It's a quick pass ahead. He does his job and fills. Archie finds him, Kelly not quick enough, Julius pulls up, makes a big three late in the game to close that gap to five. Big, big play. You must relay calls. So when a guy makes a call, you have to relay. Let me explain why. If we catch it near the NBA line, they can't guard us on the bounce. Why do they want us to catch it 50 feet? So when you start bouncing, everybody can what? Converge. Yeah, they can't do it when you're catching it. So don't leave a guy out there. Work to get free, circle cut. Don't push off, use your hip, and then be strong with the ball. Don't break open until the guy's ready to throw it to you. And really, all this stuff I'm telling you, we've been saying for seven weeks. So there's no change in this. Some teams will shoot more threes, some teams won't. Some teams are going to rebound more. Some teams won't. Some teams play fast. Some teams will pull it back. 
This team wants to spread the court and shoot threes. You do this together by having fun. We hear the chant of Go Big Blue coming up from the cheerleaders down to our right. Suleiman driving right baseline. Blocked by Goodwin. It's batted away. Loose ball. Alex digs it out. Right side to Goodwin. To Wilcher in the corner. Three on the way. Good. Kyle Wilcher. Cross court pass to Mays. Mays guarded by Thornton. Feeds it down low to Poitras. One dribble. Dunks. Wow. Power dunk by Alex Poitras to give Kentucky its first lead. Knocked away out front by Noel. Plumley gets it back. Noel knocks it away again. Off to Wilcher. Feeds it ahead to Mays. Mays into the paint. Eight-foot jumper. Good. 9-5 Kentucky. Under 14 to play. 9-5 Kentucky. Holly Stein left to the lane, backing down, spins to the baseline, banks it in, foul, Plumley. Count it for Willie Holly Stein. It's 11 to 7, Cats. Poitras into the lane, shoots over, Plumley lays it in. Wilcher's got it, 15 feet out, left of the lane. Just holding the ball, now puts it on the floor, turns into the paint, nice feed under to Noel, dribbles once, turns and dunks. Plumley's got his back to Noel, turns into the paint with a runner, no good. Noel grabs the rebound. He falls down and gets the pass off to Wilcher. Ahead to Goodwin. Kentucky fans wanted the foul call. To the trailer, Mays. Back out front to Goodwin. His three good from the top of the key. Kicks it behind him to Wilcher. Fakes right, goes left, bounce pass down to Noel. Turns into the lane, leans in, puts it in. Uh, Noel going strong. Dribbles once, passes to Goodwin in the left corner. Goodwin dribbles out to the wing, steps back, 18-footer, good. Poitras runs it down, passes out to Wilcher, back to Poitras in the left corner, a three, good for Alex Poitras. Noel, free throw line, hands it to Mays, curling for a jumper, in and out, no good, jammed in by Alex Poitras, flying in off the right wing. When he shows you that, that just leads you to believe that he could do a lot of that. Wilcher, top of the circle, lob and a dunk! For Archie Goodwin. Kentucky moved everybody high and let Archie Goodwin roll off the pick at the elbow. He was wide open. And Excellent. Wilcher put it right at the rim. Beautiful pass. His fourth assist. Poitras top of the circle. Crossover dribble. Gets into the lane. Spins. Shoots over Suleiman. It rolls in. Duke comes out with it. Another Kentucky turnover. Ahead to Suleiman. Into the lane. Shots blocked by Noel. Loose ball out front. Chased down by Curry, but he dribbled it on the sideline. Kentucky ball. Now dribbles once. Hands it off to Goodwin. Open three. Right of the circle. No good. Rebound. Poitras lays it in. And Poitras and Harrison get tangled up down low. Noel on the right baseline. 15 feet out. Shot clock at 10. Off to Cauley Stein. Cauley Stein drives into the lane. Banks it in. They swing it to Goodwin on the right side. Dumps it down to Noel. Turns into the lane. Left hand layup. Good. Good one on the point for Kentucky. To the high post to Noel. Shovel pass to Poitras for a dunk. Coming in on the right baseline. 58-46 Duke. Noel knocks it away. Comes up with the steal. To Mays. Ahead to Wilcher for the dunk. Defense leads to the easy two. Kind of changes that momentum. Duke by 12. Good one. Lobs it to the rim. And a dunk for Noel. Nice roll after Noel sets the pick. Goodwin finds him with a lob. Six straight for Duke to keep Kentucky at bay. Mays in the circle, 18-footer. No good. Tap, jam by Poitras. Oh, my. He went above the rim with that right hand and just slammed it through. Plumley into the lane. Ball knocked away by Noel. And Wilcher comes up with it. Here come the Cats. Goodwin right side. Back to Mays. Three, right wing. Good. The steal, the quick hands of Nerland's Noel. Dribbles over toward Coach Cal to get some instruction on the left side. Goodwin on the bounce to the rim. Lays it in. Nice job. He knew where Plumlee was. Screened. Let his man, his teammate, screen Plumlee out of the way. Good basket. Timeout Duke. Big Blue Nation on its feet in Catlanta. is Kentucky Basketball was brought to you by Baptist Express Care Clinics by KCTCS by the Kentucky Office of Highway Safety by UPS by your local Ford dealer by Lexington Clinic and by Kentucky Farm Bureau Insurance and by Kentucky's Touchstone Energy Cooperatives Central Bank Arby's Central Baptist Hospital Golden Corral, Kroger, and by Dairy Queen.